As filmmakers, a lot of us fantasize about going to those big, prestigious international film festivals like Sundance and Toronto and Berlin and Venice and the granddaddy of them all, the Cannes Film Festival. Well, I'm honored to say that for my very first feature-length work, a documentary called Lady Wrestler, I got to go to the Cannes Film Festival. I'm here at the 70th Annual Cannes Film Festival. I made it. Now, my documentary, Lady Wrestler, was not selected to be screened at the Cannes Film Festival, but how I got to go was I got accepted into a film market called the Marche du Film. Now, a film market is exactly what the name implies. It is a big international marketplace where everyone who is passionate about film, be it producers, actors, writers, directors, financiers, all come together, they pitch ideas, uh, some ideas get financed and greenlit at these film markets and sometimes it's just a place to make connections and to network and so that is what was the case with me. It was a place to network, to make connections. I met sales agents, I met other filmmakers, I met journalists who were interested in my documentary. And the documentary, by the way, is this really interesting story which I believe has worldwide appeal about these really phenomenal African-American women who defied segregation and racism back in the 1950s and became internationally famous professional wrestlers. So I'm so glad that I got to go to the Cannes Film Festival and spread the word about these amazing ladies and this amazing story. You would be surprised at how diverse the audience is for the Cannes Film Festival. The festival really attracts a broad spectrum of people from all around the world. I mean, I met people of all different races. I met everyone from hip hop star Akon to uh, veteran African American actress Beverly Todd. She was on a panel discussion. And that is another thing about this film market, the Marche du Film, that takes place during the Cannes Film Festival. There are all kinds of panel discussions and workshops about every aspect of filmmaking from financing, from how to get government credits and government tax credits to help make your film, to casting. There are famous people everywhere you look, so it's a great place to, to network and get your name out there. And of course, if you get the opportunity to go, which I highly recommend, take plenty of business cards. And I have to say the south of France, the Cannes region, the Cannes area where the Cannes Film Festival is held, really is paradise. It's beautiful beaches, beautiful sunshine, and of course, beautiful people. Everyone was, real, was really friendly. I got to go to a couple of really cool movie screenings. I got to go to the screening of a family drama called the Meyer Owitz Stories. And really the pinnacle of the experience was getting to go to a screening at the Grand Lumiere Theater, which is the big theater on the Croissant, or Croissette rather, the, the, the main strip in Cannes where all these screenings and, and big events with all the movie stars and big time directors are held. First I got to stand at the side of the red carpet and see all the movie stars and directors coming and going. I got to see Nicole Kidman, Mary J. Blige of all people. She was there for the movie Mudbound, which she was Oscar nominated for. Got to see Dustin Hoffman, Emma Thompson, Colin Farrell, Adam Sandler got to see all these big time people and then I got to walk up the red carpet where all these famous people had had tread and go into the Grand Lumiere Theater for a screening of a movie starring Isabelle Huppert who is basically the French Meryl Streep so I got to be in the theater with her and the other actors in the movie I was up in the balcony and they were down on the main floor but still I was there and that was really an amazing experience they were playing they were playing music on the red carpet and they were playing for some reason Christopher Cross's Ride Like the Wind. Now I like Christopher Cross and I like that song but I thought it was just a kind of an odd choice to be playing on the red carpet in 2017. Gotta love the French. Overall my experience at Cannes was overwhelmingly positive. As I said if you get an opportunity to attend a big film festival or a film market even just as a spectator I would highly recommend it. It's really a great opportunity to network and to make connections with other people who are passionate about film.